Hello and welcome to BLW. Back here again with another non-LEGO brick set. Today we're going to be taking a look at Snap and Switch, officially licensed Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle construction set. Now this is called the Cheapskate with Raph. Now, as you can imagine, this comes with Raphael. You can see him right here. Um, I have already commented on these characters before in the last version of this I did, but basically they're not perfect, but I do tend to like them. What I really like, of course, is that these are compatible with Lego. Um, so you can take the head off and the shell and move it to a Lego minifigure if you want, if for some reason you think that would look better. Now, this contains 113 pieces, and just like every other Snap and Switch set, costs $5 and can be bought at 5 below. Now, as of right now, they only have this one and the Pizza Parlor one that I reviewed last time. So you can only get Raph and Mikey. They don't have um, the other turtles available currently or any sets for them. Now, of the two, this is my least favorite. So you do get this, I'm guessing it's supposed to be like some giant powered skateboard type deal. Um, and it's honestly, it's a kind of cool build. You know, you get a little gun on the front, an area for him to stand, the fan on the back, and then there is this chain that connects, um, and he can hold it in his hand when he's not holding both of his weapons. So there are two weapons, but I would rather him have him holding it in his hand. Kind of reminds me of one of those electric skateboards where you know you have the hand trigger that you pull to make it go forward and I imagine that is what they were going for and now what's interesting is that this I believe counts as a snot build because you are actually building it up sideways so just to give you an idea you actually build it up this way and then basically flip it over and there are just a few studs on the top to let him stand and to build the fan apparatus in the back. Now it does have a side build, which is this traffic light, which honestly I like this traffic light. A god awful fire hydrant. Um, yeah, I, I don't like this fire hydrant at all. There are a thousand different ways to do fire hydrants better than this. And a city sewer um, porthole cover which this would be great if it was either one large piece or even a smaller piece. However, this is actually five pieces all being covered by the same sticker. So there is a center piece and then four outside pieces. Now they also all rest on this, which in and itself, I mean, it's not a bad design, but the way it's held together is terrible and it fell apart a lot during my building process. Overall, I'm only going to give this one a 6 out of 10. Even though it has more pieces, um, it's just not as good as the Pizza Parlor set. But again, it is only 5 bucks, And just for 5 bucks, I'd pick it up just for the minifigure, even if it's not an exact Lego minifigure. So anyway, that is all I have for you guys today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time with a brand new brick video. Thanks for watching.